I would choose glass. You know, I always thought that uh, paper rice for um, Eastern tradition, you know, with the game of shadows, is something that very much represents that kind of culture. Our culture is a transparent culture. We always have to tell the truth, we always have to be transparent. And, and the, I love the fact that, you know, the way you do glass, the way you blow glass, you know, the fire and the water. I mean, it, it's so, it's, uh, it's really like the creation system. So it's, it's, um, it's such a strong metaphorical material. And um, it's, um, it's, um, it's a not natural material, but it's perceived as if it's natural. So that it's also interesting. You know, it's a composite material, but it's perceived as natural. So that I would say glass. I would say glass, definitely. Glass has got a lot of challenges. You can do a lot of mistakes. And it's got its own rules. If you don't know them, everything breaks. You know, it's, it's really, it's like walking on a thin line that divides, you know, the good from the bad, you know. The, the, it's, um, it's very nice to, you know, take a walk on the wild side, but it's a very <laughs> thin line. I believe that the real creative people are the ones that go in the forest and there is no traces of other people that went before you, you know, so that it's, uh, it's, it's, it's really, otherwise you are a follower, you're not, you're not someone that is making the path, you know, and, uh, and I only talk about people that make the path, I mean, they are the only one that interests to me in some ways, because um, I'm interested to braveness, you know, for me, you, you need to be brave in order to go to some places where no one has been, and, uh, and actually, that's the thing I always wish to all new designers, be brave, you know, because it, it's too easy to play in defense. This is a time in which all the, 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 um, the big horizon of project is playing in defense. There's so much memory, there's so much, uh, um, everybody's scared in some ways. We need to be much more brave. This is crazy, I mean, it's like, I mean, unavoidably things are new, unavoidably. But the, the, um, the point is, we are polluting too much, but not only in a, in a material sense, in a physical sense, also in a visual sense, in a semiotic sense. There's so much pollution around. You know, before we were talking about, they were telling me, did you see some good news? I cannot see anything, there is too much stuff. I need so much time to process all these informations, you know. And because, of course, I'm, I am, I'm too sensitive probably, you know, and uh, it takes time for me, but, but it's really, there's not so much need to do all these things. You know, since I was a, a very young um, designer, and, and the student as well. You know, I always used to say, I used to challenge all my colleagues. I used to say, let's try to do directly our best of. Let's not do a lot of bullshit and then we take only a few things and say, this is our work. No, let's try to only make things that we are very proud. You know, things that really will testify our path. That will make the difference, only the best of. Just make your best of. You know, do less but do it better. Normality. My superpower is normality. You know, I dress like Clark Kent, but I know I'm Superman.